Hey guys, it's Ariba and I'm back with another makeup tutorial. Today I'm going to share with you guys how to create this really dewy highlighter finish. I'll be doing a full face and chest contour using my new Iconic London products. For my base, I'm going to be using their Pigment Foundation Stick in the shade Butterscotch. And for my blender today, I'm going to be using this new blender that I just got. It's Silk Blender and it's like really squishy and you can wipe it down and reuse it without having to rinse it or anything. And what I realized with this blender is that you don't need to use that much product because it's not absorbing any of it. Can you hold this one for mommy? Can you hold this one? Yeah, hold Thank you. Wait two seconds? Okay. Thank you, Liz. For my highlight, I'm going to go in with Nude with Warm Tones. For my contour, I'm using Champagne with Warm Undertones. These sticks are so awesome because I could just use the flat part of it for the areas that I want a heavier contour and for the finer areas like my nose, I can use just the edge of the stick and get a really fine line with it. My stick! <laughs> Does mommy look scary? Here, can you blend mommy's makeup? Okay, so I'm not gonna lie, she didn't really do a good job blending my makeup. So I'm gonna go in with my silk blender and blend all the highlighted areas first. And then I'm gonna go in with this one for the finer areas like my nose. And now I'm just wiping it clean. I'm actually just using a baby wipe. And I'm going to use the base of the blender to blend away all of my contouring. And to set the lighter areas, I'm going to go in with NYX Cosmetics No Filter Finishing Powder in Porcelain. And I'm going to grab my Eloise Beauty contouring brush to set my contour into place with the shade Coco. What happened, Nails? Is it cool? It fall down? Yeah. Uh oh. It's cool. Ow. Say sorry? Say sorry. Say sorry. Say sorry. Ow. Or say sorry. Sorry. Did you give mommy a boo boo? Uh oh. Oh, let's first blend your makeup, baby. You need to blend your tuck tuck. You have to blend it. You want this one? And then I'm going to grab the iconic London Illuminator in the original shade. What color is it? What is that? Pink. Say highlighter. 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 High high. Highlighter. Okay, mommy's gonna use it first, and then Aliana can use it, okay? okay. Alright, take it wait. Okay, ready? Oh, say blangin. 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 So this highlighter you can use as a base for a powder highlighter. You can also blend it in with your foundation. You can also just use it on your own. I'm going to set mine with a powder highlighter because I really want my highlighter to pop. And I'm just using a foundation brush to blend everything away.
And to keep the glowy theme going, I'm going to grab my new Huda Beauty Lip Strobe in Angelic for my lips. Very pretty nails. I never thought there was such thing as too much highlight until right now. I think you put on a bit too much. Huh? What do you think? Is that too much? And then I'm just going to set all the highlighted areas into place using the Huda Beauty 3D Highlighter. So glowy! I'm obsessed with this highlighter. Don't forget guys, I'm not a makeup artist by any stretch of the imagination and if I can do this makeup, you definitely can. I really hope you guys found this tutorial helpful. If you did, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, make sure you share it with your friends, leave me a comment below letting me know what you think and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. 